MMC 2019, grade 7, question number 1. Bella is 5 feet, 3 inches tall. Convert her height in meters. So we know that 5 feet is equal to 60 inches. Okay, so we need to add 60 plus 3 inches. So that is 63 inches. Now, this inches, we're going to convert into meters. In our con conversion, we know that one inch is equivalent to 2.54 cm. So we can now cancel inches, inches. Multiply 63 times 2.54 will give us 160.02 centimeters cm because our unit is cm. Now, we have the conversion. We need a unit of meters. So cm, we're going to move 2 to the left. So 2, 1, 2. So the answer is 1.6 meters. Okay. Next, question number two. Convert 1.5 liters to milliliters. So in our conversion, we have the milliliters, centiliters, deciliters, liter, decaliter, hectoliter, and kiloliter liter to milliliter so how many moves one two three so this 1.5 1.5 we're going to move three one two three so that is equivalent to 1500 milliliters Next, number three. <laughs> Evaluate 3x squared minus 2y cubed when x is equal to 2 and y is equal to negative 1. Since we have values for x and y, let us substitute. 3 times our x is 2 squared minus 2 times our y is negative 1. 3 times 2 squared, 4 minus 2 times negative 3 cubed, negative 1. 3 times 4, that is 12. Negative 2 times negative 1, positive 2. 12 plus 2, 14. Number 4. Evaluate quantity 2 cubed raised to 2 minus 2 cubed times 3 squared. So let us solve. 2 cubed is 8. That is 2 times 2 times 2. Square minus 2 cubed is 8 times 3 squared, 9. 8, 8 squared is 64 minus 8 times 9. 72 64 minus 72 negative 8 final answer number 5 arrange in increasing order 22 over 7 so let us write into decimal 22 Divided by 7, so that is 7, 14, 21, 3, 21, subtract 1, point zero, zero. so 3.1, so 7, subtract 3, 0, 0, 7, 14, 21, 28. So, 3.14, 21, 
28. So subtract 2, 0, 0, 7, 14. So 2. Okay. 3.142, 22 over 7. We have 3.15. That's enough. The square root of 3. The square root of 3 is between the square root of 1 square root of 2 square root of 3 square root of 4 we know that the square root of 1 is 1 the square root of 4 is 2 that means the square root of 3 is between 1 and 2 so that would be our lowest because pi is 3.1415 so let us arrange, square root of 3 is the lowest, square root of 3, followed by 3.1415, the pi, followed by 3.142, or 22 over 7, and lastly, 3.15. So this is now the increasing order of this question. Question number six. Find the product of 5.71 times 10 raised to negative 8. Quantity 1.28 times 10 raised to negative 12. Round your answer with the appropriate number of significant digits. So let us multiply 5.71 and 1.28. So get the product. The product is 7, 8, 8. If we're going to multiply this, you will get 7.3088. Now we have this 10 raised to negative 8 and 10 raised to negative 12. So we're going to multiply it to times 10, we're going to add the exponent negative 8 plus negative 12, that is negative 20. Or we can rewrite as 7.31 times 10 raised to negative 20. Okay. Next, number 7. The conversion formula from Fahrenheit to degree Celsius is C is equal to 5 over 9, quantity F minus 32. At what temperature are F and C equal? So take note, our condition is F and C are equal. So we can substitute C is equal to 5 over 9. F and C are equal, so we can substitute F to C. C minus 32. Now, we can remove 9 by simply cross multiply. So that will give you 9C is equal to 5 times C minus 32. So distribute 9C is equal to 5C minus 5 times negative 32 is negative of, so 10. Get a 1, negative 15, 160. So transpose, 9C transpose 5 minus 5C is equal to negative 160. 9C minus 5C, 4C is equal to negative 160. Divide by 4, so our C is negative 40. The final answer. So F and C are equal if at negative 40. Number 8. Convert the repeating decimal 0 0.141414 and the ellipse sign into a fraction form. So we can rewrite this as 14 over, since this is repeating, 99. If you want an 
explanation more that is equivalent to 14 bar 0 0.14 bar will it give us 14 over 99 next number number 9 the minimum speed for expressways and highways in the Philippines is 60 kilometers per hour Calculate to the nearest whole number the distance in meters that a car travels in one second. So let us use this one. So we have 60 kilometers per hour. We're going to multiply. Our unit must be meters per second. We know that one hour is equivalent to 3,600 seconds and one kilometer is equivalent to 1,000 meters let us cancel we have one zero here so cancel one zero at the denominator six and 36 cancel this will be one and this will be six one zero, one zero numerator. So cancel kilometers, cancel hours. So we have 100 meters over six seconds. So divide 100 divided by six. So one, six, subtract four, zero. 40 divided by six. 6, 12, 18, 24, 32. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36. 6, 36. Subtract 4. Point zero, zero. So that is 16 point, 6, 12, 18, 24. 16.6 or in whole number that is rounding up, so it will become 70 meters. And last one, number 10. Express the decimal 2.2125 in fraction form as a quotient of two integers. So 2.2125 over, so we have four zeros. One, two, three. So let us remove the decimal. Reduce in lowest term that is divisible by by five. So if this is divisible by five, so you can reduce that and the answer will be seventeen over Yes, this is the final answer. Reduce is equal to 17.8.